He's painfully thin. He's crouching over a lot of the time. He has bowel issues like you wouldn't believe. He eats and it doesn't seem to be going anywhere. And of course, John can't tell us what's wrong because he can't speak. I have been fighting for a long time to get people to hear me as my son is growing up but thinner and thinner and thinner and thinner, and he's wasting away in front of me. I don't know what to do. There must be consultants, doctors, specialists within the UK who would want to look into this situation, but even trying to get blood tests arranged on the NHS for an autistic child meets with a lot of caution and it's most unfair. We have been in contact with the medical team, the 18 medical team, and they have seen photographs of John, and it's come to the conclusion that John needs to be seen ASAP. Ali and I and John are gonna to go to New York and we are going to film every part that we can of this procedure so we can bring to you exactly what's going on with John. He has the autism associated and drug colitis. That's exactly what he's got. Overall, this is good news, not bad news. It's all treatable possibility. It's the answers it's, it's, to everything. Yeah. What a lot of parents say is that they feel vindicated, that they weren't crazy. Um, yeah, no, you're not crazy. Is this the first moment his entire life that he hasn't felt any pain. The change in John has been absolutely dramatic, absolutely dramatic physically, and there have been consequential mental changes in him as well. To look at him, he is a different child. He has the physique of a normal 14-year-old child now. Within three weeks of being back from New York, he is completely out of nappies. So that in itself is amazing. We are absolutely convinced that his quality of life has improved immeasurably since the treatment. And it's proved he can learn. Yeah. It's proved he can learn. The expertise that we have we have found gives us hope for the future. I said thank you. Thank you. Well, I'm just one piece of many. So all in all, do we say success? I think so. Absolutely. I think that he's on the right track and I'm excited to see what happens. So it's a huge success. If you have a parental instinct that something is seriously is wrong, you must go further.